If you're a member of SAS, you can choose how your super is invested. But how do you decide what's right for you? You need to make a decision about your super, otherwise your money will be automatically invested in the growth option. If you've left the public sector and deferred your benefit, you'll be climbing up a mountain with 100% of your investment tied up in a growth strategy. This potentially means higher returns over the long term, but there's also a greater chance of slipping down as your money is exposed to the ups and downs of investment markets. If the markets fall, have you got enough time to recover any ground you've lost? The amount of risk you can take a few years out from retirement is often very different to someone with many years still left in the workforce. However, if you're still contributing to SAS, only a small amount of your super, your personal contributions will be exposed to the elements. So even though you'll still have market ups and downs, overall, you're on a more conservative path. Whichever side of the mountain you're on, you need to be regularly reviewing your path and deciding if a different option might be better suited to you. The way you invest your super makes a huge difference to your retirement lifestyle, and that's why it's so important to get professional financial planning advice. So give your member service team a call, and remember, the sooner you start planning, the better.